So I finally finished one ball of yarn. Um, it's 51 yards. This is actually a lot more than I thought I was gonna get done with. So I chained 71 and made it big enough to where I felt like I would be comfortable with it. It's gonna be a thick one. It's gonna be a thick blanket. It's gonna be really heavy. Um, I'm excited though to see how it turns out. Um, I have four more balls left. I think, I think that should be enough. If not, I'm gonna go back to Michael's and pick up some more. But as of right now, I think this is great. I'm excited. Let's just get back into it.
So after doing two rows of this pink, I think it turned out good. I was scared at first that I, did, I wasn't gonna like it, but I think this is gonna be cute. This video pink is gonna turn out really nice. So I think I'm gonna do two more rows of pink on this side and then I got another um, ball of yarn and I'm gonna put the other like four rows of pink on this side and then the baby blanket will be completed. I'm super excited. I'm so ready for this to be done. My niece and nephew are supposed to be coming over next weekend. So I wanna have something for them to be able to lay on. Um, my mom says she's bringing back their baby blankets, but I don't believe her. So this is an option for them to just lay on like the floor and stuff like that to lay on. All right, let me finish this up and I will show you guys the final product at the end. Okay, so this is the blanket. Technically, it'll be like this. So when the kids use it, it'll be like this. It is... 64 inches long this way and it is let me check I don't know how long how wide it is and it's 25 inches wide um once the children are gone I will be using this as a like a throw or like a like a leg pillow i mean a leg blanket for when i'm on the couch so you may see this pop up again but that is all for this video thank you all for watching please like comment and subscribe if you enjoyed this content and i will be back again next friday see you later bye